Our top news this week. Atomos has some great news for filmmakers using the Zcam E2 cinema camera. Thanks to an upcoming firmware update, Atomos will be supporting 12-bit ProRes RAW recording to the Ninja V from the Zcam E2. Atomos and Zcam are also working together on touchscreen camera control on the Ninja V for the E2 cameras. This way users will be able to operate their cameras and adjust key settings from the Ninja V Atom OS touchscreen. This functionality alongside ProRes RAW support will be available in a firmware update scheduled for release in June. Panasonic recently unveiled their latest AK HC3900 HDR Studio camera with an upgrade path to native 4K 50 and 60p acquisition. The Panasonic HC3900 represents a cost-effective HDR solution for broadcast with support for all common HD formats and the ability to be easily upgraded for 4K broadcast applications. Combined with high sensitivity and low noise, the new studio camera also benefits from access to an intuitive CCU as well as the ability to simultaneously output SDR and HDR signal. There is some light at the end of the tunnel for UK film and TV productions. According to a report in Screen Daily, the Department of Digital, Culture, Media and Sport has confirmed that film and TV productions in the UK can soon resume as long as they comply with social distancing guidelines of keeping two meters apart and regularly washing hands. However, before productions can resume, there are still issues to be ironed out regarding production insurance, which productions need before resuming work. Also following the government announcement of relaxing lockdown measures, we are reopening our VI rental department in Teddington, London, as of May the 13th, while adhering to official government advice and measures ensuring the safety of both staff and customers. That's it for this week. We'll be back next week with more news in 90 seconds.